So, I'm Mike Willey. I am the Vice President of Technology for Paragon Innovations, a TTI company. And I'm Mike Wilkinson, General Manager and Vice President for Paragon Innovations. Mike, I got to thinking about some of the things that have made us successful over the last 31 years. And one of the things I think that has really helped us is relationships with vendors. One of the things people don't understand, unless you're an engineer, is how important it is uh, to have a great relationship with vendors. We're always using new technologies. And the only way we're going to understand how to use those is to get support from those vendors, get them to get us the data that we need, uh, maybe even engineering support from within the company. And most engineers don't understand uh, natively, we certainly aren't taught in school, how to deal with vendors. And uh, I wondered what you thought about that. Well, I agree. Um, so I don't think engineers understand why vendors come out. They're, they don't come out, they're not paid to come out and just bring data books or in the old days or bring data and show. They're, they're there to sell silicon. And they're hoping to sell silicon in quantities to the contract manufacturer that eventually builds the product. And so, you know, if you work with them and, 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 and treat them right and tell them where the product's gonna be made, give them accurate numbers on what you think the volumes are gonna be, and really work with them and treat them as a partner, you're gonna get great support. And, and we, like you said, we need support more than ever because today's parts are very complex. You know, back in the day, it was a 14 pin dip and it was a quad two input NAND gate. No big deal, you can figure it out on your own. But today, these, you know, millions of gates on a part, it's difficult to understand the complexities of the part and the software interfaces for it. Um, RF, parts today, the radios especially. So we need that support and the best thing we could do to, to help our suppliers is let them know uh, what, the, what the path is to their commission, because that's where their money is. Yeah, and you know, it's gotta be hard for somebody who's been assigned to call on Paragon to come back and tell your boss, he says, so, how many parts do you think Paragon's gonna buy? Oh, they'll probably buy 30 pieces. Yeah. And so why did you go spend two hours over at their office? Well, because they're gonna sell a million parts a year from now at the contract manufacturer. That's you just right. gotta connect the dots. And I know over the years we've had it's so much easier today, but back in the day, you'd, you'd suddenly get, your rep would disappear and you'd call and they'd say, well, we've been uh, taken off your account because of no volume and, and, um, and it's like you're on telesales. It's like, what? And, uh, and, you, and, and they eventually figured that out, the vendors. And you know, TTI better than anyone figured this out. I mean, that's really oh, yeah? part, of the, part of the reason to acquire Paragon is that you know, we're gonna be, have traceability all the way to the end for selling parts and of course TTI and their uh, uh, family of companies sell about everything so it's easy to hit the line card. Yeah and it's uh, you know it's it's uh, it can be an investment for these guys because yeah. I you remember the the product that we had it was a, um, uh, it was a, a remote IOT device uh, and one of the parts that we had there was an error in the data sheet that wasn't documented, yeah. and we spent, what, 60, 80, maybe even 100 hours, I don't remember, of engineering time trying to figure out this problem, because we were doing the right thing according to the data sheet, right. but we called the vendor, and because we had that good relationship, they not only provided us access to their engineers, they brought us into their lab to help us troubleshoot that. And, you, you know, you can't pay for that kind of support. That's right, that's right. So again, I guess in summary, we, uh, we need good relationships with our vendors, and I think the more that engineers understand that uh, will help them and help everyone very well. Yep, when you treat people like you want to be treated, it works every time. Absolutely.